Last week, we finished fourth at Pocono because of my plan to wreck Denny Hamlin, who was leading at that time, failed, and instead we settled for a fourth place finish. But Matt Kenseth ended up with a win, so I'm not complaining. Today, we are going to be doing the Big Machine Vodka 400 at the Brickyard. Um, this is the Indianapolis 400, pretty much. The, the, the Brickyard 400 is pretty much what this, this is. Um, unfortunately, this is not what it's going to be this year. It's going to be the road course again like it was in the 2021 season. They're going to be doing the exact same thing in 2022, and I don't think it's a good idea at all. Qualifying at lap starts now. we got to qualify at least a 56.5. Um, that's what we got to do at least to get the pole. Um, hopefully that happens because this is a tough racetrack. I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's a very tough racetrack. And um, you never know what's going to happen. But hopefully everything goes good. Almost hit the wall there. Don't want to do that. Got the pole, boys. Let's freaking go. Well, I don't have to ask guys who won the pole because your boy won it, baby. Let's go. Green flag is out here at Indianapolis Motor Speedway. We got 21 laps of this great racetrack. And uh, hopefully we go Toyota's have taken the top two spots so not off to a good start um, Toyota's actually do dominate pretty good here um, besides on the road course William Byron getting a little loose already From a first to fifth in not even the first lap. We made it out of the first turn and we kind of dropped some points. But Kurt Busch is going to make a little run for it. But your boy is going to be able to pass him with a good run. I'm going to do something that a lot of you guys are going to be happy about. If I can do this, I'm going to try and do it for all you people. Kurt Busch with a dominating car. He's so quick right now. Holy crap. What did Chip Ganassi Racing do to that race car? The two Bush brothers, first and second. Hopefully we can shake that up a little bit. Well, I tried to pit maneuver him, but it didn't work. Don't worry, we'll get him. Joey Logano making an appearance in the top five. Careful, still there. Still there. Careful, still there. Clear low, clear low. Oh, 
Oh, Kyle Bush spun. Oh, and so do we were wrecking, we were wrecking. Oh, holy crap. I want to know what happened to Kyle Bush. I don't even think I touched him. I'm not 100% sure. We're going to have to watch a replay of this race. That is for sure. Kurt Busch has damage to his car. Kyle Busch got a lot of damage to his car, and I have a little bit of damage to my car as well. Hopefully, uh, this goes good, and uh, we don't have to pit or anything, because that would kind of suck, not going to lie. Let me at least lead one lap. That's all I want is to lead one lap. I'm right here, Lagana, you freaking idiot. I'm... Do you have like a spotter or anything in there, Lagana? You got like anything in there right now? There's a car here. There's a car here. There's a car here. Side draft, little door ding there. We're in the lead, boys. Let's go. Can't even hold it for a single lap. We need a pit, guys. Like, this car... It's getting, it's too tight. Like we need to loosen this car up a little bit. Unfortunately, definitely gonna be pitting. I'm sorry. Okay, so, we are going to make these 20, that a 20, that a 40, tape, 20%, take a little bit of wedge out of the car, um, let's try that, and I think that should be good to go. We might go a lap down here, but I don't want to go a lap down. Hopefully this pit crew can work good enough and quick enough that we don't go a lap down. I think that they will because there's not a lot of damage to this race car. And there's a caution. That's going to save us a lot of freaking time because we are not going to pit. Would you look at that, boys? That worked out very good in our favor, but kind of screwed us over at the same time because we had just pitted, but oh well. At least we're not lapped down and we have the lead in hand. Car, on the outside now. car feels so much better already. Like I can just tell right now, this car feels so much better. Logano trying to get the win, but he ain't going to get it. I'm not going to give it up. No way.
this car is just too good to be true right now. It feels so good, like all the adjustments and everything that we made to this car. I think we made, made a right decision. So a lot of you guys are telling me for when this season is over to do the Jimmy Johnson chasing the 8th Cup Championship. Because that would mean we've technically done Toyota, Ford, and Chevy. But I already know who we're going to do next year, boys. I already know what's going to happen when the season is over. I already know what's going to happen. I already know what we're going to do. It's already been planned. And a full-on schedule has been planned out already as well. And uh, we're also going to have a lot of new tracks coming to the schedule. Um, it's going to be more than 36 races, that's for sure. Some tracks are going to lose one of their dates. Um... Like, Pocono's gonna lose a date, um, I know that, and Phoenix is also gonna lose a date because the championship is not gonna be held in Phoenix like it is gonna be this year. A lot of things are gonna be changing for the next one, boys. I think you guys are gonna like it because it's gonna be pretty cool. And, um, sadly, there's no Bristol Dirt or Circuit of the Americas, um, because that would have been absolutely great if that happened. It would be absolutely amazing. Out, Caution is out. Let's see what happened. So something happened with David Reagan. I don't know what happened exactly, but something happened. I wonder if he got pit maneuvered or something like that. Green flag is out again. We got two to go. Hopefully, same thing that happened last week on Sunday doesn't happen again today because that would not be good. Joey Logano, you're not getting this one from me, buddy. Not today. Not happening. I think it like put him in the fence there just a little bit. I think give him like a little love tap or something. White flag presented by Credit One Bank. Let's see, boys. What happens? Do we crash and wreck? Does Joey Logano catch us? Or do we ride it out to the finish? Final time coming off the turn three and four on it to the front straight away. We are gonna tie Kyle Larson from 2021. We are gonna tie Kyle Larson in wins here today at Indy. Let's kiss those bricks, baby. I'm gonna do one a fat burnout right on these bricks. We're gonna do a burnout right on these bricks. Burn them up. Because we love the brickyard. So sad to see this race go to its freaking road course. Kind of sad, but I love this racetrack and I love everything about it. Two hundred five. Six, seven, eight, 208 miles an hour, a burnout.
Got this car moving pretty quick, boys. Okay, I want to see this replay on what happened with Kyle Busch. So he got loose from there, and then the caution came out, and I spun. First place at Indy, and now we are going to go to Kentucky for the Quaker State 400, presented by Walmart. 35 laps, let me know in the comments if you guys want to change that to a little bit lower laps or if you guys want to keep it that way and it's going to be a night race as well so that is going to be fun all right guys that's going to be it for today's video don't forget to leave a like comment subscribe share the friends if you enjoyed if you're interested in getting a gaming computer please click the link in the description below this video if x gaming pcs absolutely fantastic computers and if you guys use code squad sqad you guys can get 10 percent off you guys hear that correctly 10 percent off peace out and i'll see you guys in the next one Yee.